Is it okay to start giving uh, backlinks to an article with no traffic? The domain already has traffic, but the specific article still has got zero clicks on the SERPs. Uh, yeah, absolutely. You don't need to wait for anything to build backlinks <coughs> to your site ever, really. Doesn't like any, your homepage or, you know, basically the only thing I would wait for before building backlinks is just having a page with content on it. Um, you know, I think you could technically build backlinks to pages on your website that don't even exist yet. Uh, is that a best practice? Probably not. Uh, but you, you could do it. And I think it would eventually end up working out just fine. But maybe not if you did it like a whole bunch. I don't know. I, Google might be like, this is kind of weird. I've never really Anyway, I don't, I'm, not, say, I'm not saying to do it. What I'm saying is, is you really don't need to wait for anything. <laughs> uh, you, don't, you don't need to wait for your site to get traffic. You don't need to wait for an individual page to get traffic. Uh, if the page is there, that's enough. You can go ahead and build links to it. Uh, you know, it'd be completely normal for someone who uh, went out and wrote a, you know, an amazing article on the benefits of whatever protein, uh, some protein powder or whatever, and then, uh, you know, reached out to a bunch of health blogs and we're like, hey, you gotta check out this research, this, you know, this awesome article we did on this. This is really good stuff here and, you know, promote it essentially, and they could end up linking to it. And, um, you know, there, there's absolutely no nothing to stop someone from doing that ever. And so Google would in no way, shape or form, uh, you know, try to penalize you or something for it looking unnatural. You can just go ahead and do it as soon as it's up. Um, do you have anything to add on that? I note? mean, yeah, hey, you know, I always like to bring it back to if you're unsure, then create a narrative where this can exist in the real world. Remember that something doesn't just have to have momentum online for it to get press, which is essentially what backlinks are. There's some form of press. People, people can be talking about something that you've been talking about. Maybe your business was on TV. Hypothetically, Google doesn't know that, so they can't write it off completely, right? But invent this scenario in your head where something actually happens, right? Or could potentially happen. Um, this article just went up, um, you know, that specific day, it could already have press tied to it from factors that don't exist online, be it commercials, be it word of mouth in your local area, et cetera. And if it's something that cannot definitively be categorized as against what happens normally online, then it's not something that uh, you could get penalized for if you think about it, right? And oftentimes, um, you know, it's it's just it's going to show that you've got um, press going to that particular asset or page within that asset, and it's going to do well for you. Um, we don't wait at all. However, um, typically, uh, we build authority sites, and so. What you'll come to find is the longer you work on these authority sites, the less you really have to prod at the inner pages um, and you kind of just get momentum via building out the um, website as a whole um, by doing natural anchors over time uh, to the home page. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Be sure to check the links below for more info on this topic as well as other cool stuff like SEO case studies, our Facebook community, and our link building services. And like always, please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Thanks and happy ranking.